if you like to have healthy choice of bread you can always try this recipe wholemeal dinner rolls for this recipe I'm using 440 grams bread flour with 160 grams whole wheat flour this this is actually cracked flour you can use spelt flour too then I have 50 grams butter one egg 30 grams sugar and I'm using bread improver in this recipe for, uh, so I have nearly 6 grams bread improver 3 grams salt and the most important ingredient 7 grams instant dry yeast and to start this recipe I added the bread flour and the wholemeal flour into the mixing bowl into that going to add the yeast and next add the sugar the egg and going to add the bread improver if you can't find the bread improver don't worry about that but when you add a little bit of bread improver it gives an extra softness into the buns so going to add the butter and going to add water little by little until it makes a smooth dough and going to I didn't add the salt so I'm adding the salt into a corner where there is no yeast so mix it well and keep on kneading about 25 minutes I was kneading this dough about 25 minutes now so I'm going to leave this in a greased bowl in a warm place until it double in size so the wholemeal bread dough is ready so I'm going to put that onto a floured bench top and if you find the dough is a bit sticky you can always add more flour and flour your hands and start kneading it punching down to get the excess air out like this and keep on kneading about two minutes it it makes this the bread dough more smoother than the normal so keep on kneading about two minutes after take a log out from that and then cut the log into equal size pieces if you like bigger bread rolls you can make bigger or the smaller ones so i cut the bread dough into 16 equal size portions and going to leave that on the bench top covered with a damp cloth about 10 minutes so i left the dough about 10 minutes and going to take one piece out and make a bowl out from that and then make it to an oval shape and leave it on the bench after roll the dough into an oval shape like this if you need more flour always add more flour when you are rolling the bread dough don't worry about adding extra flour so roll it at as much as you can then hold from one end and take the other end and roll it nicely to the end always take it to the corner rolling like this slowly the more the layers the buns are nicer so roll it nicely and leave it in a baking tray leaving to prove and put that in a warm place again to double in size the wholemeal bread rolls are ready to go to the oven 180 brush the tops with eggs and bake this about 20 to 30 minutes or until golden brown I finished baking the wholemeal bread rolls and I just took it from the oven and if I open one to show you how it looks like it's really soft and moist and you can fill it with anything that you wish or have it as a dinner roll hope you will enjoy this thank you for watching